Welcome to another devotional from International Prayer House Ministries. Today's devotional is entitled, Unanswered Prayers. Prayer can be seen as communication with God. It is God's ordained method of obtaining His blessings and help in times of need or trouble. The Word of God admonishes us to pray always and not to faint or become weary. However, scripture and experience make it clear that there are times when our prayers go unanswered or are not answered according to our expectations. What do we do at such times? David's prayer for the life of his and Bathsheba's child in 2 Samuel chapter 12, verse 15 to 23 is a case in point. He asked God to spare the life of his sick child, but that did not happen. Another example is Paul's repeated request for release from his so-called thorn in the flesh in 2 Corinthians 12, 7. Then, although we may speculate as to what the thorn was, we know that it was not pleasant. Nonetheless, the Lord's response was that his grace was sufficient. Even the answered prayers often beg puzzling questions. Why was Peter set free when the believers prayed while James, the brother of John, was executed? Why were some biblical heroes of faith enabled to subdue kingdoms, walk righteousness, obtain promises, and stop the mouths of lions, according to Hebrews chapter 11, while others were mocked, scourged, imprisoned, stoned, sawn in two, tempted, and slain with the sword? The answer is, we simply don't know. What we do know is that Almighty God in His sovereignty allows or disallows certain things. We can't explain it. We must embrace it by faith, knowing that He is Alpha and Omega and never makes a mistake. Be encouraged today that your unanswered prayers do not indicate that God does not love you. On the contrary, we must trust that he acts in our best interest and the fulfillment of his divine will. He promises to cause things to work together for your good and according to his purpose. Our view is limited by understanding and knowledge. God is not limited in any way. What seems unanswered to us may very well be answered by him just in a way we don't fully recognize. Indeed, know that God will grant us the grace to deal with any unanswered prayers, for He is in control. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you today for your goodness and your mercies, and we thank you for the promise that you have given us of answering our prayers. You hear the petitions of our heart. And even now we trust you to give us the grace in the name of Jesus to deal with prayers that may seem unanswered to us, dear God, knowing and understanding that you are working a better purpose for us. So even now, I pray today that your peace will be upon all the hearers of your word today, O oh God, and that your blessing will be upon them richly. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Thank you for listening today and may God bless you in Jesus' name.